I don't know who I am anymore. What am I supposed to be doing with my life? I'm lost. Where am I going? I should be further in life right now. Why can't I find my path? Hello and welcome to I Am. I'm David Andrade. Most individuals will go through questioning their life and where they stand amongst their dreams and life positions, running into an identity crisis sometime in their life. And most importantly, how we can find empowerment and growth through this transformative experience. First, I will continue to use the word crisis, but moving forward, get rid of the word crisis, right? And replace that word with discovery. Crisis, just the word crisis is tormenting and limiting. Using the word discovery is awareness and growth. So let's get started. What exactly is an identity crisis? Well, an identity crisis refers to a period in our lives where we experience a deep sense of uncertainty and confusion about who we are, our values, our purpose. It's a moment when we confront the question, who am I, at the core of our being. This introspective journey is beautifully captured by the power of the phrase, I am. The concept of I am holds tremendous significance. It represents the essence of our existence, our unique individuality, and the potential within us to define our own identities. An identity crisis arises when we feel disconnected from this fundamental truth and find ourselves grappling with doubts and questions. During this time, we may question the choices we've made, the paths we've taken, and the roles we've assumed. It can manifest in different aspects of our lives, such as our careers, our relationships, or even our overall sense of self. We may find ourselves yearning for an alternate existence, searching for a deeper understanding of our values and purpose. But let me assure you, an identity crisis is not a sign of weakness or failure. It's a transformative process that invites us to delve into the depths of our being and rediscover our authentic selves. It's an opportunity to explore our passions, confront our fears, and align our actions with our inner truth. By embracing the power of I am and reconnecting with our core identities, we can navigate this period of uncertainty with clarity and purpose. An identity crisis starts to expose how your mind has been efficiently processing your life. It's essential to recognize the signs that indicate you might be going through an identity crisis. These signs serve as a wake-up call beckoning us to explore the power of I am and embark on a journey of self-discovery, how we feel. One of the signs is a persistent feeling of restlessness or dissatisfaction with our current circumstances. We may sense that something is amiss, that there is a misalignment between who we truly are and the life we are living. This restlessness urges us to delve deeper into our authentic selves and seek more meaningful existence. Another sign is a constant sense of being lost or disconnected. We might find ourselves questioning our place in the world, feeling adrift in a sea of uncertainty. This feeling can manifest in various aspects of our lives, from our relationships to our careers. It's a powerful invitation to reconnect with our core identities and rediscover the path that resonates with our true selves. We can see where we should be, but we can't touch it. Why? Additionally, a longing for something more meaningful in our lives is a clear sign of an identity crisis. We yearn for a sense of purpose, a deeper understanding of our values, and the impact we can make. This longing propels us to explore new possibilities, challenge our beliefs, and seek out the path that aligns with our authentic desires. By paying attention to these signals, we can embrace the power of I am and embark on a transformative journey of self-discovery. Recognizing the signs allows us to acknowledge our need to discover more empowering choices and strengthens us to take necessary steps to navigate through the identity crisis and build our true self. An identity crisis is not merely a period of uncertainty. It's a transformative journey of self-discovery, guided by the power of I am. During this profound exploration, we have the opportunity to tap into the innermost depths reflect on our passions, values, and personal narratives, and gain a deeper understanding of who we are, who we truly are. 
to discover the ring of life we exist in, as I cover in my book. Self-discovery is an invitation to reconnect with the essence of I am within us. It is a process that goes beyond surface-level exploration and delves into the core of our being. As we embark on this journey, we open ourselves up to new possibilities, allowing our curiosity to lead us towards uncharted territories. This transformative process involves exploring new interests, both within and outside our comfort zones, expanding our ring of life. By embracing diverse experiences, we challenge and expand our perspectives, gaining valuable insights into our own capabilities and desires. We unearth hidden strengths, passions we may have overlooked, and talents waiting to be nurtured. All this with the power of choosing, with no change involved. We begin to understand where our mind has efficiently processed our lives, and now it is time to understand and rewrite our journey. Introspection becomes our trusted companion during this journey. We delve into the depths of our thoughts, feelings, and beliefs, questioning and reevaluating the narratives that have shaped our identities. Through introspection, we gain clarity of what truly resonates with our authentic selves, allowing us to make conscious choices aligned with our values, our true identity. In the quest for self-discovery, we must open to the transformative power of experiences that stretch our boundaries, that expand our ring of life. By choosing to immerse ourselves in new environments, cultures, and perspectives, we expand our understanding of the world, and in turn, ourselves. These encounters offer fertile ground for personal growth, enabling us to unearth facets of our identity that have remained dormant or hidden by a false sense of self, or as I call it, the FLS, the false life script. Through the journey of self-discovery, we peel back the layers of societal expectations, fears, and self-imposed limitations, revealing the essence of I am that resides within us. We reconnect with our authentic selves and embrace the unique qualities that make us who we are. We begin to see how our mind has been written and where supposed limitations are only a process by which our mind is keeping us efficient and safe. A redirection. A redirection is a fundamental component of the identity crisis journey. It invites us to embrace a transformative power of I am. It beckons us to step into the unknown and be open to new possibilities even when they may seem unfamiliar and uncomfortable. By wholeheartedly embracing new choices, we create fertile ground for personal growth and evolution and rewriting the subconscious mechanical parts of our lives. As we navigate an identity crisis, we may find ourselves confronted with the need to choose to adapt to new identities and perspectives. This process can initially evoke feelings of unease or uncertainty because our current identity needs to maintain the efficient pathways that currently exist both good and bad. New choices are required to let go of familiar aspects of our lives. However, it is through this very process of adaptation that we find the strength to grow and evolve. This is all done by understanding and applying the powers of I am, understanding mind before mechanics. Embracing new strengths of one's identity requires cultivating resilience, a quality allowing us to bounce back from the challenges and setbacks. It is the willingness to face the unknown with courage and determination, knowing that within our choices lies the potential for profound transformation. By developing resilience, we build solid foundation upon which we can navigate the upheavals that accompany an identity crisis. In order to embrace our new choices, we must also be willing to let go of outdated notions and beliefs that no longer serve us. This act of rewriting enables us to make space for new experiences, perspectives, and identities to emerge. It requires a conscious effort to shed the layers of conditioning that may have constrained us in the past and embrace the limitless possibilities that lie ahead. This is accomplished through mind-before mechanics, understanding that we build our lives emotionally, live our lives mechanically, and are again rewarded with emotions. We can advance a powerful part of our identity by choosing to rewrite our I am. It's important to remember that an identity crisis is not a sign of weakness, but a testament to our innate ability to adapt and thrive. It is through rewriting our I am that we discover new facets of ourselves, unearthing hidden strength and unlocking untapped potentials. Embracing I am the key, my new definition of self, 
is an act of self-empowerment as we take ownership of our personal growth and embrace the transformative journey of the identity crisis. You know, as we continue our exploration of the power of I am, we arrive at a pivotal phase in the journey of an identity crisis, finding meaning and purpose. Amidst the confusion of uncertainty, it is through the lens of I am that we embark on a profound quest to rediscover what truly matters to us, and importantly, how to build our I am, to understand how to rebuild and rewire our identity. To find meaning and purpose, we must first reconnect with our passion, what ignites our souls and fills us with joy. By identifying our true passions, we align ourselves with the essence of I am and open doors to a more fulfilling life. It could be through creative endeavors, community service, or pursuing hobbies that resonate deeply within us. By embracing our passions, we allow the power of I am to guide us towards the sense of purpose and rewrite our beliefs, our identity. Self-reflection becomes a powerful tool as we navigate the labyrinth of identity crisis. It allows us to delve into the depths of our being and explore our strengths, weaknesses, and aspirations. By embracing introspection, we gain clarity on the true desires and the paths that aligns with the power of I am. Through self-reflection, we uncover the intricate layers of our identities, unveiling the purpose that awaits our discovery. Self-reflection begins to open our mind on how we have been functioning, living, how our mind has been processing our life, as we start to see what is beneficial and what is not. In this pursuit of meaning and purpose, it's essential to explore different paths and experiment with new activities, embracing the unknown and stepping outside our comfort zone and expanding our ring of life opens doors to new possibilities. Each experience becomes a stepping stone to our journey of self-discovery, guiding us closer to the realization of I am in its fullest potential. Remember, the power of I am lies within each of us. It is the driving force that propels us towards a meaningful existence. By embracing our passions, aligning our values with our actions, engaging in self-reflection, and exploring new paths, we unlock the door to life rich with purpose and fulfillment. And now we build a new identity to bring our purpose forward. Now we come face to face with the transformative power of I am in embracing personal growth amidst an identity crisis. This pivotal phase is where we truly understand the depth of our own potential. Embracing an identity crisis requires us to confront our fears head on. It is through this courageous act that we begin to unravel the layers of our being, exposing our vulnerabilities, our insecurities. By acknowledging and addressing these fears, we step into the realm of self-awareness that propels us forward on the path of personal growth. And personal growth is understanding to rewrite our identity. Challenging our beliefs becomes an integral part of this transformative process. It requires us to question the narratives we've constructed about ourselves and the world around us. By examining our beliefs, we create room for new perspectives and possibilities. The power of I am expands as we let go of limiting beliefs, allowing us to embrace a broader understanding of who we are and what we can become. Being open to choosing our life is key to navigating an identity crisis. Rewiring our identity can be uncomfortable, as it often pushes us beyond our familiar boundaries. However, it is through the willingness to embrace our new choices that we unlock our true potential. By embracing the power of I am, we become adaptable and resilient to the face of uncertainty. We discover that choosing to expand is not something to be feared, but an opportunity for growth and transformation. Through this journey of personal growth and rewriting our identity, we emerge from identity crisis as stronger and wiser version of ourselves. We exit this journey with a new platform to exist in. We tap into a wellspring of authenticity that enables us to live in alignment with the essence of I am. The power of self-awareness, authenticity, and happiness becomes our guiding light, illuminating the path ahead. Now there are steps that need to be followed to truly rewire our identity. Remember, we live our lives based on efficiency of identity. Not good, not bad, but efficient. Our minds will conduct our life with ease of execution a life that has been nurtured and repeated over and over again. And again, not good, not bad, but efficient. 
You must break the chains of conventional thoughts of change and understand that choosing is growth and change is merely attempt. Remember, the power of I am lies within each of us. Embracing personal growth means recognizing the immense potential that resides within by choosing our I am. By confronting fears, challenging beliefs, and being open to conflicts, we harness the power of I am to navigate the labyrinth of an identity crisis and emerge as empowered individuals. Through the power of I am and the I am method, you can learn how you can control the so-called crisis of identity. Embrace your ability to choose your life and personal growth journey, for it holds the key to unlocking your truest self. You are, I am the key. Repeat this every day. I am the key. Let your mind know who you are. You are the key to your life, and no one else holds it. You are the bearer of the power you seek. Go out there and take a bite out of life. Thank you. Pick up a copy of my audio or paperback book at www.immethod.com and go through the worksheets. And please share this podcast. My goal is to help people understand to never change their lives, but to choose their inherent gifts of greatness.